good morning students uh, exercise 2.8 first question if omega not equal to 1 if omega not equal to 1 is a cube root of unity so that A plus B omega plus C omega square uh, C omega square divided by B plus C omega plus A omega square plus A plus B omega plus C omega square divided by C plus A omega plus B omega square equal to minus 1. So we have to prove that this equal to minus 1. So first we will get this part. A plus B omega plus C omega square by B plus C omega plus A omega square plus a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by c plus a omega plus b omega square equal to first term you have to multiply <coughs> omega both numerator and denominator by omega so omega into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by omega into b plus c omega plus a omega square plus Second term we have to divide by multiply and divide by omega square a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by omega square into c plus a omega plus b omega square. So this is equal to now omega into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by multiply omega inside denominator. So b omega plus c omega square plus a omega cube plus a yeah, omega square into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by uh, multiply omega square into denominator so omega c omega square plus a omega cube uh, plus b omega power 4 this is equal to omega into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by b omega plus c omega square plus a into omega cube value is 1 so 1 into 1 plus omega square into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by c omega square plus a plus b omega power 4 can be written as omega power cube into omega this is equal to omega these two get cancelled so omega plus omega square into a plus b omega plus c omega square divided by uh, c omega square plus a plus b into omega cube value is 1 1 into omega omega so these two get cancelled that is equal to omega plus omega square as we know that 1 plus omega plus omega square equal to 0. So from this omega plus omega square equal to minus 1. Equal to or which is. Clear? Now sixth problem. If omega not equal to 1 is a cube root of unity so that the roots the roots of the equation the roots of the equation z minus 1 the whole cube plus 8 equal to 0 or minus 1 comma 1 
become 1 min sorry minus 1 1 minus 2 omega 1 minus 2 omega square so given z minus 1 the whole cube solution z minus 1 the whole cube plus 8 equal to 0 so z minus 1 the whole cube equal to minus 8 so z minus 1 the whole cube equal to minus 8 can be written as uh, minus 8 into 1 am i right that is z minus 1 the whole cube equal to minus 8 into 1 can be written as in polar form how will you write 1 there is one more step 1 that is z minus 1 the whole cube equal to z minus 1 equal to how will you write minus 8 the whole power 1 by 3 into 1 power 1 by 3 am i right so z minus 1 equal to minus 8 can be written as minus 2 cube the whole power 1 by 3 1 power 1 by 3 that is z minus 1 equal to minus 2 the whole cube is minus 2 am i right so minus 3 3 cancel minus 2 minus 2 1 1 power 1 by 3 cube root of unity what are the values 1 comma omega comma omega square so z minus 1 equal to multiply minus 2 minus 2 omega minus 2 omega square therefore z equal to minus 2 plus 1 comma z equal to minus 2 omega plus 1 comma z equal to minus 2 omega square plus 1 therefore <coughs> the roots are what are the values minus 2 plus 1 can be written as minus 1 minus 2 omega plus 1 can be written as 1 minus 2 omega here 1 plus 2 omega square that is the answer now 7 this sum find the value of sigma k equal to 1 to 8 cos 2 k pi divided by 9 plus i into sin 2 k pi by 9 so sigma solution sigma k equal to 1 to 8 cos 2k pi by 9 plus i into sin 2k pi by 9 equal to this can be written as 1 to 8 so sigma k equal to 0 to 8 cos 2k pi by 9 plus i sin 2k pi by 9 minus we have to subtract this one 0 because 1 to 8 is there am i right so we have to subtract cos 0 plus i sin 0 that is equal to 0 to 0 to 8 means 1 plus omega plus omega square plus omega power 8 1 plus omega plus omega square plus etc omega power 8 minus cos 0 value is 1 plus i into 0 that is equal to 1 plus omega plus omega square plus omega power 8 value is 0. 0 minus 1 uh, minus i into 0. That is equal to minus 1. That is answer. Because 0 to 8 means we will get the root. How many roots we will get? Uh, 9 roots we will get. So 1 plus omega plus omega. First root anyway we will get 0 means cos 0 plus i sin 0. So 1. Then next root whatever may be omega. Next root whatever may be omega square. So up to omega power 8. 
am I right? So 1 plus omega plus omega square plus omega power 8 value is 0. As cube root of unit is 1 plus omega plus omega square equal to 0. Same way, 8th root of unit is 1 plus omega plus uh, omega square plus etc. omega power 8 equal to 0. Clear? Uh, it is not 8th root, 9th root. Sorry, 9th roots of unit is 0. Because 0 to 8, no? So 9th roots of unit. Then question number 8. If omega not equal to 1 is a cube root of cube root of unity cube root of unity show that first part 1 minus omega plus omega square the whole power 6 plus 1 plus omega minus omega square the whole power 6 equal to 128 second part 1 plus omega into 1 plus omega square into 1 plus omega power 4 into 1 plus omega power 8 etc 1 plus omega 2 power 11 equal to 1 so first part we have to prove that 1 minus omega plus omega square double power 6 plus 1 plus omega minus omega square the whole power 6 equal to 128. So first part LHS. 1 plus omega sorry 1 minus omega plus omega square the whole power 6 plus 1 plus omega minus omega square whole power 6 equal to we have to arrange in order so 1 plus omega square minus omega the whole power 6 plus uh, 1 plus omega minus omega square the whole power 6 this equal to 1 plus omega square is minus omega minus omega the whole power 6 plus 1 plus omega is minus omega square minus omega square the whole power 6 that is equal to minus 2 omega the whole power 6 plus minus 2 omega square the whole power 6 that is equal to minus 2 power 6 is common then remaining omega power 6 plus omega square the whole power 6 that is equal to minus 2 the whole power 6 into omega power 6 can be written as omega cube the whole power 2 plus omega power 12 so omega cube the whole power 4 that is equal to minus 2 power 6 uh, 2 power 5 32 32 into 2 64 so minus 2 power 6 is 64 into omega cube is 1 1 square plus 1 power 4 that is equal to 64 into 1 plus 1 equal to 64 into 2 so we will get 128 so first part answer is 128 now second part so LHS 1 plus omega into 1 plus omega square into 1 plus omega power 4 into 1 plus omega power 8 etc 1 plus omega power 2 power 11 equal to we have to prove that 1 
So first you <coughs> here 1 plus omega into uh, 1 plus omega square into 1 plus omega power 4 in etc 1 plus omega 2 power 11 so this equal to we can write this as here how many times etc this equal to etc 12 times 12 times because 1 plus omega is 1 time 1 plus omega 2 2 power 1 2 square 2 cube etc 2 power 11 so 2 power 1 1 2 3 etc 11 times is there so 11 plus 1 12 times then we have to arrange in 2 2 times we have to take together so how will you write 1 plus omega into 1 plus omega square 1 time etc uh, how many times this is if you consider 2 times as single time so we will get 6 times am I right now this equal to um, 1 plus this can be written as 1 plus omega the whole power 6 into 1 plus omega square the whole power 6 that is equal to 1 plus omega is 1 plus omega is minus omega square the whole power 6 into 1 plus omega square is minus omega the whole power 6 so this can be written as uh, minus omega the whole power 12 so omega power 12 into omega power 6 so omega power 12 can be written as omega cube the whole power 4 into omega cube the whole power 2 that is equal to omega cube value is 1 1 into 1 equal to 1 equal to r with this If z equal to 2 minus 2y, come on, find the find the rotation of z by theta radians in the counter clockwise direction. about the origin when first part theta equal to pi by 3 second part theta equal to 2 pi by 3 third part theta equal to 3 pi by 2 <coughs> so first given <coughs> Uh, given z equal to 2 minus 2i we have to find the uh, you have to write in polar form so r of cos theta plus i sin theta that is z equal to sorry r equal to root of 4 that is 2 square plus minus 2 the whole square that is equal to this already you know that am I right so shall I write directly root of 4 plus 4 that is equal to root 8 that is equal to 2 root when you factorize we will get 2 root
now alpha equal to tan inverse uh, modulus of y mod minus 2 by 2 that is alpha equal to tan inverse 1 so alpha equal to pi by 4 so theta lies in which quadrant cos is positive sin is negative so all silver t cups fourth quadrant fourth quadrant means theta lies in fourth quadrant so theta equal to minus alpha formula so theta equal to minus pi by 4 so you have to substitute here z equal to uh, r of r 2 root 2 into cos minus pi by 4 plus i sin pi by 4 okay so this can be written as 2 root 2 into minus here also minus Okay. So let it be. Now first part. Come to the first part. What is first part? First part theta equal to pi by 3. So we have to find uh, is it into is it into e power rotation is pi by 3 am i right pi by 3 so i set in the e power i pi by 3 that is equal to z set is set is 2 root 2 into cos minus pi by 4 plus i sin minus pi by 4 into e power i pi by 3 can be written as uh, cos pi by 3 plus i <coughs> i sin pi by 3 <coughs> that is equal to 2 root 2 into uh, here it is a product so the angles we can add it so cos minus pi by 4 plus pi by 3 plus i into sin of minus pi by 4 plus pi by 3 that is equal to 2 root 2 into LCM cos lcm is 12 so here we will get uh, 3 minus 3 pi plus uh, into 12 so 4 pi am i right plus i into sin of minus 3 pi plus 4 pi divided by 12 so that is equal to 2 root 2 into cos of pi by 12 am i right cos of 4 pi minus 3 pi is pi, pi by 12, pi by 12 plus i into sin pi by 12, that is sans. same way second part, theta equal to 2 pi by 3, theta equal to 2 pi by 3, so is set into e power i 2 pi by 3. That is equal to 2 root 2 into cos minus pi by 4 is at value. Minus pi by 4 plus i into sin minus pi by 4 into e power i 2 pi by 3 is exponential form. So how will you write in polar form? Cos 2 pi by 3 plus i sin 2 pi by 3. <coughs> that is equal to 2 root 2 into uh, product. Product means how will you write? cos of minus pi by 4 plus 2 pi by 3 plus i into sin of minus pi by 4 plus 2 pi by 3 that is equal to 2 root 2 into cos of lcm is 12 so minus 3 pi plus into 12 <coughs> 8 pi plus i into sin of minus 3 pi plus 8 pi divided by 12 that is equal to 2 root 2 into cos of 8 pi minus 3 pi 5 pi so 5 pi by 12 am I right
plus i in the sine of pi pi by 12. So that part again you try to do as homework. That part is what uh, theta equal to 3 pi by 2. So this is left as homework. Okay. Now last sum, this exercise last sum, tenth sum. Prove that the values of the values of fourth root of minus one or plus or minus one by root two into one plus or minus i. Okay. <clears throat> Find the values of this one. So we have to take let uh, is it equal to minus 1 the whole power 1 by 4 am I right so is it equal to minus 1 can be written as cos pi plus i sin pi the whole power 1 by 4 in co in polar form how will you write cos pi plus i sin pi the whole power 1 by 4 now this equal to add 2k pi to this argument that is cos of 2k pi plus pi plus i into sine of 2k pi plus pi the whole power 1 by 4 now next step cos of uh, lcm sorry common what is common here pi 2k plus 1 into pi plus i into sine of 2k plus 1 into pi the whole power 1 by 4 now this equal to cos 2k plus 1 into pi by 4. We have to multiply 1 by 4 inside. Pi by 4 plus i into sine of 2k plus 1 into pi by 4. Where k equal to 0, 1, 2, 3. So when k equal to 0, when k equal to 0, what we will get is it equal to uh, cos pi by 4 cos pi by 4 plus i sin pi by 4 so that is equal cos 1 by cos pi by 4 45 degrees 1 by root 2 plus i into 1 by root 2 same way k equal to 1 is it equal to cos 2 into 1 2 2 plus 1 3 cos 3 pi by 4 plus i sin 3 pi by 4 that is equal to <coughs> cos 3 pi by 4 can be written as cos of pi plus mm, sorry pi minus pi by 4 4 pi minus pi 3 pi by 4 plus i into sine of uh, pi minus pi by 4 that is equal to cos uh, cos of 180 minus theta is minus cos theta minus cos pi by 4 plus sine of 180 minus theta sine theta sine pi by 4 so we will get the minus 1 by root 2 plus i into 1 by root 2 similarly k equal to 2 k equal to 3 can you find it this left as homework so, so and check it whether this answer is coming Our two roots we got it 1 by root 2 plus i into 1 by root 2 uh, second root minus 1 by root 2 plus i into 1 by root 2 then remaining two roots we have to get so finally this is the answer okay students thank you